All right, so this video, we're gonna talk about the difference between two different fog light packages. Um, I'm sure a lot of you have been out there shopping for fog light packages. And unfortunately, um, what seems like one thing may be cheaper than the other and so on, that doesn't necessarily mean it's the same thing. Um, there's certainly different options for different capabilities, different things that you want to do, different things you want your lights to do, and so on. Um, but I want to clear up some confusion with this video. So on the left side, you're going to notice the rigid um, Radiance series lights. Now you may have seen some of these out there for the 2017, 18, 19 Raptor, and they have a cool halo effect that glows amber, as you see here, like your parking lights and your marker lights. So if that's the effect you're looking for, then that's an option for you. The other option that you have is the Pro Series Rigid Kit that I have, which is a series of three different lights. The one to the far right is the uh, Driving Series. As you see, it has six LEDs, and it's going to be a combination of, of near and far it's going to be very, very bright off-road, all right? The one in the center, and it is getting a little dark out here, but um, is an SAE, which means that it's street legal. So you can drive with that on the street, and, and you shouldn't have any issues as far as getting tickets and that sort of thing. And the one to the far center is going to be a spot. So that's going to be a very, very narrow beam and a long distance. If you use all three of them at the same time, you're going to get light coverage in just about every aspect that you could possibly need in an off-road setting. On-road, you can use your SAE. Now I want you to notice the main difference between this series of lights and the reason that this series of lights is more expensive and it doesn't have the halo is because it's a lot brighter. Um, they're going to do a lot more for you as far as the off-road and the visibility. All right, so to the right you'll see you have six LEDs. All right, the middle SAE has four and the spot has four. Now on the Radiant Series, and the Radiant Series is a great uh, option as well, less expensive, but they're not gonna be as bright, all right? Each one has one LED, one, two, three. So you're gonna have three LEDs on each side, a total of six, versus a total of 14 on each side for 28 LEDs. Of course, these are more uh, purpose specific, um, where one is near, one is far, one is a combination, one is street legal, and so on. Um, these Radiant Series should probably be street legal um, because they're not gonna be nearly as bright as the other. Definitely a cool effect, like I say. Um, and the Radiant Series is just a little more than half the price of the Pro Series. But again, it really depends on what you're looking for. Now. One other thing I want to touch bases on, and this is important to know, these are not amber lights. The Radiant Series is not an amber light. So if you're looking for an amber light for visibility and snow and sand and that sort of thing, the Radiant Series is not an amber light. They're white lights, they just have an amber glow. So they're not amber, they're white with an amber glow, just like the parking lights. You do have an option with this Pro Series of replacing this spot with an amber floodlight, which is going to provide the coverage that you need. And we can do different combinations of these lights if that's something you wanted to do as well, if you wanted some other combinations. You could replace the SAE with an amber if you wanted to and keep the spot and the driving combo. But again, these do different things. So I'm gonna go ahead now and flip on the actual LED lights so you can see how bright they are. All right, so this is gonna be difficult. It's gonna be really difficult really to tell when the, the camera's aiming right at these lights, but these lights on the right are gonna be lots brighter. I mean, there's not even a comparison to how bright they actually are. Um, let me try to get at an angle so you can kind of get an idea. So you can see that's a lot of light coming out of those. Now I'm gonna go at an angle here with these others. There we go. You get it just right, you get some reflection, but um, 
not nearly the brightness. I'm gonna go ahead and back up. I'm gonna aim them at the, the garage door so you can actually see it there as well. But as you notice, that amber surround is still on, but you don't see it anymore. So again, these aren't amber lights. Cool effect, if you like the um, Radiant series, obviously we've got, we've got those available for sale. I think they're $5.99, and the Pro series, I believe is $9.89, or $9.81, I'm sorry, for the Pro series lights. That includes the brackets, the mounting, and, and everything. Uh, as far as that goes. All right, so now I've got this truck backed up. I've got both sets of lights on. As you can see here, both sides are on. And I have them aimed here at the garage door. And you should be able to tell pretty clearly that the left side with that Pro Series light is a lot brighter than the right side so again, it really just depends on what you're looking for. If you want that cool halo effect, go with the Radiant series. If you want the brightest option, if you want those brightest off-road lights, definitely go with the Pro Series combo. Uh, rigid set that I have again at specialtyperformanceparts.com. The last thing I'd like to talk about is the uh, custom mount grill light bar kit that I have for the 2017 18 19 Raptor, and it's a flush mount light. It's a combination spot flood, it's 45 degrees of light, 15,600 lumens. as you can see, really lights it up. All right, so this is without the light bar, with both sets of fogs, that's with the light bar. Without the light bar, with the light bar. So again, that combination of fogs and light bar really, really, really give you a lot of options. Now, um, you might decide, hey, I kind of like the look of that that Radiant Series light, but I want some extra light too. And you could sacrifice the fog side of that bright light. You could just go with the light bar. So go with the light bar and go with the Radiance fogs. You know, that's, that's a nice combination as well. And that still gets you that, uh, you know, um, that halo, that, that orange or that amber, you know, uh, effect like the, the uh, marker lights, if that's the thing you're looking for. Um, you can do that and still get that bright light with the, the light bar. But if you want the brightest, brightest, brightest combination out there, then you want to go with that Pro Series rigid set that I have here on the driver's side. All right, so this complete light setup is actually very, very cool. So let's go ahead and try these out here at night. So first I'm going to turn on these spotlights, um, then the SAE lights, now our driving spot flood combo, and the light bar. You can see all the lights actually um, fill a different gap in coverage. Um, unbelievable amount of light that these things put out. I mean, look at that. Lights it up just like the daylight. So, Be sure to visit SpecialtyPerformanceParts.com and you can get any of these lights that you like, um, whether it be the Radiant Series, the Pro Series, the 40-inch light bar, and many, many, many more things for your Raptor or performance off-road truck.